Okay, we've got a few sort of larger holes I expected it with this really because um, it's so sort of porous so full of holes that they're going to get little airlocks so I'm just going to use a bit of um, glass cast 3 mix that up with the same color put a little bit of metallic in there to give it some topaz green a little bit of metallic you can see some of them here kind of like woodworm and rot so it's a bit too deep for your kind of fast setting CA glues. So I'm going to use a glass cast three in there, scrape it on. I'll keep going back to it just to push it in the holes as it starts to cure. And in a day or so, I'll be able to sand that. So when you're refilling some of these holes, you can see there the woodworm, um, some sort of shallow cracks that didn't actually fill on the first pour, even though I flooded the table. You need to put more on than you think because it seems to puddle around and move out of the holes. So you need to work it into the holes, keep coming back to it. And when it starts to go a bit more, I mean, this has just been poured, but when it starts to go a little bit thicker, it starts to look like it's setting, curing, then you can get your scraper, push it right down in those holes as it becomes more elasticated. And even though this looks a bit messy now, this is no problem because one, it's such a small amount of resin and this is done at uh, 80 grit on the wide belt. I'll do one pass at 120, take all that off and then I'll be orbital sanding. So hopefully that will stick in those holes and we'll come back to that um, tomorrow or the next day when it's cured. So for the tiny little holes, just a little bit of super glue is good.
So I'm using super glue, I don't usually use it, but as you've seen, some of the insides on this wood is a bit soft. So the good thing about super glue is it does give you a little bit of uh, lubricant going in, but it definitely firms up the thread and any of the soft down here. normally sink these in flush but because this table is a demo table someone may choose other legs and I don't want a great big routed out section you know we did a big one yeah because can we lift can you lift this a minute yeah yeah so we can put that on the forklift or lift it Plonk okay. it down, do some test pictures. If they work, then we've got the big boy to take out. Because the other problem we got is the, just the time of day. Remember last time we struggled. So some top finish two black. This is from Easy Composites. This goes so hard, this hard wax oil. You don't need a lot. You can actually polish it like you would a resin, even though this has been spray oiled. And there's a certain texture to it, different to wiping it on. You can actually feel it. You can't feel the resin. It's almost like it's been lacquered with a two pack. So it's quite a nice finish if you like that. Thank you. 